Hi, this is Dr. Gary. Welcome to the Daily Tune-Up here at the first of the week. Wow, over the weekend and some of last week, there's just a lot of stuff going on all over the world right now that's showing the amount of stress people are under. People rioting, picketing Wall Street, burning cars and police cars and hurting each other. What's that all about? Right now, consumers have had about as much as they can handle. Even the banks charging for petty things like the use of a debit card has absolutely got all of us in an uproar. Today I want you to consider all of these things that we watch on TV, all the news we're hearing, all the disasters going on. It seems like every time you turn around it's negative. Negative this, negative that. And really, what's got to happen is we've got to turn our thinking around and our mass consciousness around so we can turn this around. It's not going to be a politician that changes it. It's not going to be just a miracle out there of it just happening. We've got to take action. However, taking action by rioting and hurting other people, I think, could be the wrong way to look at it. And that's just my opinion. What I want you to think about today is where you stand in all of this, with your finances, with your marriage, with your life, and wherever you are in your life, whether you're just 21 years old, and I have a lot of young people watch this program, or whether you're my age, pushing 70 years old. Decide where you stand in all of this. Where do you stand in your life today? Are you accomplishing the things that you want to accomplish? Are you doing the things that you want to do? And I have to ask you this, are you doing those things because they bring you joy or because you have to? As we make this paradigm shift in consciousness over the next few years, there's a lot of weight being put on 2012, which is just around the corner, believe it or not, within 90 days. And we've got to really, really prepare ourselves for what could be a very interesting time of living. I've said for the last two and a half years, something's going on. Many of us can feel something in the air. Well, we're starting to see the results of it now. We're starting to see that human being and society breaking down on us. Whether we break down with it is really up to you. You, what you have to do at this moment right now is you have to keep your wits about you. You have to realize a lot of this stuff going on is really out of your control. But what is in your control is the way you focus on it and your intention in your life each day. You have to live your life with positive intention, not out of fear. You have to live your life ready to take action, to take care of you and your family. However, not out of disaster. That's just something we're supposed to be doing every day anyway. And also, believe it or not, I've been doing a detox here for the last little over a week now, and I'll tell you what, that'll wake you up. I feel better, however it is a struggle, and the reason I'm doing it is to clean up my body to become even more healthy because it's going to be required of all of us to become more healthy because what that literally does, as weird as this sounds, as new agey and crazy as it sounds, it literally raises our vibration inside which allows us to handle a higher level of stress, a higher level of shakiness, a higher level of not being too sure where our next dollar is coming from. So today and this week, not only do I want you to continue to visualize how you want this week to go and how you want your life to go, I want you to make some decisions this week about yourself and your family and your loved ones and the people that you're in contact with to undergird their strength, not in anger, not in stress, in confidence that they're human beings and they can accomplish anything they want to accomplish. And the first thing to accomplish is peace, love, harmony, and cooperation with the people around them. Let's work on that this week. Until tomorrow, this is Dr. Gary wishing you an extraordinary day today. Bye-bye.